When a child gets burned, the pain can be especially traumatizing. But thanks to the child life specialists at the Leonis Peters Burn Center at Community Regional Medical Center, families are supported through the ups and downs that can come when a child has a severe burn injury. Your muscles, show me your muscles too. Ooh. Ooh, let me see. This bond between little five-year-old Matthew Perez and child life specialist Rosie Lynn Rufo wasn't always so easy. When Matthew came into the burn center in December, he was shy and unsure. I went to bedside immediately and met with the patient and mom. I was able to bring in my Bubba bear and some distraction stickers, scenes that a boy his age might like, like dinosaurs. And that's how I was able to build rapport. That rapport took time because Matthew's burn injury was traumatizing for him and his mother, Annabelle. Annabelle explains the family had been in Mexico for the holidays. And then at Christmas, they come from long and Matthew has an accident. And then we're faced with what to do, you know? Do we continue to stay? Do we leave? Take them down there. There's no treatment, you know, for them. So a pot had been moved to the ground, and while Matthew and his cousins were playing, he tripped and fell into the pot and received a pretty substantial burn to his chest and shoulder. Matthew sustained um, deep second and third degree burns that required um, actually a hospitalization and surgery and um, he w stayed with us for a time here. Registered nurse Shana Henry is a burn injury prevention specialist at the burn center. While Matthew was here in the hospital, we were able to utilize Resell, which is a spray on um, skin cell technology and have found it to be incredible. Through it all, Rosie Lynn was at Matthew's side. Utilizing pharmacological and non-pharmacological approaches has been very helpful to get to know what he likes. And I found over the time that I've built that relationship, seeing him in the outpatient clinic. Rosie Lynn helped to distract Matthew when he had his dressing changes, helping him heal in a way only she could. If we can equip the kids with the preparation, the developmentally appropriate ways to teach them, it does alleviate some stress for the mom or dad at bedside. Research shows the interaction with a child life specialist can have a major impact on a young patient's healing and well-being. Annabelle says Rosie Lynn's support was crucial. So he's not really thinking of what's going on, but, you know, playing. And I honestly picked up some, uh, some great tips from her because I had to do some dressing changes at home. That wasn't easy. She's so natural. She's compassionate. She's able to build that easy connection. Um, it's very easy to see that she was meant to be in this role. Annabelle is grateful Matthew received specialized care at the burn center, and he's back to being his vivacious self. Just being here has been a blessing, having this burn center here. I can't never say how blessed we are to be able to have uh, Matthew here. Every appointment has been extraordinary. If you would like to give to the life-changing work at the Leon S. Peters Burn Center, visit communitymedical.org give.